Hello everyone, and welcome to section 6, working with .NET Core and .NET Standard. First thing, we're going to talk briefly about .NET Core 3 and .NET Standard. So what is .NET Core 3? Previously, Microsoft announced the .NET Core, and it was about creating a framework that would produce applications in native for all the operating systems. So it would be a cross-platform application. And this was introduced first in ASB.NET. And now that .NET Core was planned for it to be more than just ASB.NET, Microsoft introduced new technologies that is ported from the .NET framework, the original .NET framework, to the .NET Core, which includes the WBF framework and the Windows Form framework. So, what is the WPF and Windows Forms? WPF is the design-based application language that was designed by Microsoft to produce Windows application. And for that, you can create WPF applications that can work on any platform, including Linux and Mac OS. But somehow, Microsoft needed some way to have a general rules or general coding standards that can be interpreted across .NET Core and .NET. I have them here, my Visual Studio 2019 open, and the Create New Project dialog. As you can see, these are the type of projects. So I'm gonna type here standard. And there it is. This is the project type for the standard library, which is something that is understandable by both .NET and .NET Core. 